Hey golfers, PGA Teaching Professional Todd Coben. Today we're talking about hitting the nice low wind shot. I'm going to give you two simple tips that are going to guarantee a lower ball flight into that wind. Now the first thing we want to understand is what are we trying to do? What, what type of shot am I looking for? Well of course if it's a wind shot I want the ball to come out a little bit lower and I want it to flight a little bit lower so I can keep it kind of down and out of the wind. And so how are we going to do that? Well the first thing I want to do is I want to kind of uh, first of all let you know something that's kind of out there that isn't really true and that is that hitting down on the golf ball causes the golf ball to go higher up and that just simply is not true. When you hit down on the golf ball it actually helps lower the ball flight a little bit. So how are we going to do that? Well I want to give you a couple tips in your set. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to move the ball further back in our stance. So you know from some of my previous videos or other things that you might have filed uh, through me and my teaching is that with a quality iron shot we want the ball to be basically in the center of the stance, give or take a little bit, right? So with the wind shot we're going to move that back slightly a little bit so it's just slightly back of center. The other thing I want you to do is I want you to feel like you take the handle all right, and the shaft and you lean it slightly towards the target. That will take a little bit of loft off the face and also help draw down that ball flight a little bit. So the tip we want in order to do with the actual swing is you want to feel like the handle and the club head are working the same rate through the strike. So when I swing through the strike I feel like the handle and the club head are basically working at the same rate and my finish is shorter and my arms are basically more extended or more straight. And when I do those couple things, when I move the ball back slightly, when I lean the shaft a little bit forward, and when I can swing the handle and the club head kind of the same right through the strike, I can bring that ball flight down. And, and what I've done here in this video is I've done a couple examples. I hit a standard seven iron, went high, normal, normal trajectory, took off at a certain angle. Then I went in, got set in, did those things, I moved the ball back, got the shaft a little forward, get the handle and the club at working the same rate through the strike, you'll notice that the trajectory initially came down a little bit and the overall height also was lowered a little bit. So if you're going to play golf in the wind, you got to understand how to bring the ball flight down. The first misconception that's out there that I want you to understand is that hitting down on the golf ball will actually help you bring it a little bit lower. Moving it back, leaning the shaft a little forward, Swinging the hand on the club head through at the same rate will also help you do that. And of course, at the end of the day, bring that ball flight down and help you control those windy conditions.